Jason Kuhn. He's a sicko. He's definitely one of those more successful elite players. I know Jason tries to talk poker with successful poker players and kind of pick their brains and get into what they do and then incorporate that in his own game. A very type A. I'm very go-getter. It's important to have the balance of being passionate and, and caring about every situation, but also letting go of the things that are out of your hands. He is very calculated. Everything he does is very concise. He knows exactly when to push the go button and when to pull back. I think that if you want to be truly great at something, you can't be motivated by external things. You have to be motivated by passion and love. If you want to be successful at it, you better love it. Talking to him, he seems like a pretty normal guy, and then all of a sudden, next thing you know, he's drinking some disgusting looking shake or something, and then doing backflips randomly. He's very motivated in, in the gym and works very hard on his body. Jason Kuhn has one of the nicest bodies I've ever seen. I don't think Jason Kuhn has eaten a carb in 10 years. I have good genetics on my side, and uh, yeah, I like to work out. Oh my god, that body is just ridiculous. I mean, ridiculous. <laughs> I have always had a passion for sports ever since I was a little kid. I was very competitive at football and track. Ended up going to college for, for track and field. And whenever I came into the poker world, I, I just saw a bunch of really great people that were really good at one thing, and that was playing poker. In poker, you find a lot of fitness freaks and a lot of fat slobs. That's the thing, poker players make the excuse. They're like, oh, I'm just busy in these casinos and I travel too much. But no reality, shouldn't you be able to find maybe an hour a day to hit the gym? He realized that if we're gonna be successful in life, you also need to be healthy. And he's convinced a lot of very lazy, like stoner poker players to get off their ass and start working out and start worrying about what they eat. I think if you're sitting there with your head held high and uh, feeling good and strong about yourself, your table mates are gonna see that as strength. Where are all the guys in the middle? <laughs> That's what, I, that's what I want. <laughs> Playing those long, grueling days, it's important to be in good shape and be able to sit up with good posture and feel strong and have energy all day long. And that's something that training definitely gives you. Clarity, releases endorphins, helps your brain work more efficiently. All these things are important to making money. You know what I'm saying?